Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and in this video I'll show you how to color grade this picture. So first I want to go selective color and then select here reds and I am giving 42 for cyan and minus 5 for black and then go to the yellows and minus 100 for cyan then plus 100 for magenta plus 100 for yellows and 55 for black then go to the green and minus 100 for cyan plus 100 for magenta and minus 100 for yellows that's good and then go to the black and plus 8 for cyan and then plus 3 for magenta and plus 20 for yellows and then plus 4 for black that's good look at this this was the before and this is after it looks great and then go to the gradient fill option select radial and select inverse and choosing this gradient that's good it will create a vignette effect increase the scale a little bit so that's good look at this this was the before and this is after it looks great you can always decrease the opacity i think 80 percent is good for me and then create the curves and select rgb here let's make it big a little bit and bring this point a little bit up create a point like this I think this is good and then go to the green and just add some green just a little and then go to the blue just a little not too much yeah this is good look at this this is before and this is after and then I have to create another curves here and bring this point like this and also little bit up and bring this little down just a little not too much i think yeah that's good and i want to create another gradient map here and i'm selecting this gradient change the blending mode to soft light and decrease the opacity around 14 percent i think yeah this is good if i get to the round a little bit i think yeah this is good so the color grading is done it's really easy and quick let's see the before and after this was the before and this is the after it looks great if you want you can add some light from here just like this create a new layer then pick a soft brush and I think white color Decre increase the flow and now press ctrl and T to resize it just a little I think yeah this good and decrease the opacity a little bit I think this is good create another layer and pick an orange color I think this is good and just click and change the blending mode to screen 
and then press Ctrl and T and make it bigger. Just like this. Let's see the before and after. I think I should decrease this opacity more. I think this is good. It's optional if you want, then you can add this. So I think this is good. Let's see the before and after. This is the before and this is after. So I hope you will love this video. If you did, hit the like button, leave your comments and don't forget to subscribe.